four children lost their lives in a tragic fire in Mason City two weeks ago. Today, a memorial service was held in their honor as their friends and loved ones gathered to remember the precious lives lost. Our Darian Letty was at that service today. Darian, what can you tell us? It was a solemn day for the Mason City community as they mourn the lives of these four young boys. Hundreds of people gathered in the Lincoln Intermediate School for the memorial service. There were family members, friends, teachers, and one of the boys' Boy Scout troops at the service. Deacon Regan Banks, who ran the boys' youth group, led the funeral. A number of people spoke, including family members, the boys' teachers, and local Salvation Army majors. Speakers talked about each of the boys' personalities and interests and the love they gave and leave behind. During the speech, folks were seen wiping away tears and hugging one another. Their father, John Michael Sr., also spoke. He talked about the love he has for his boys and the family dog, Frody, who also died in the fire. He then played a song that he would often play for the boys about counting your blessings. He says he wants to use this time to remind families to have a fire safety plan in place. That I lost my boys that I couldn't do everything I could do or could have done to prevent it. I feel like a failure, but I know I'm not. Everybody comes and tells me what I did, how hard I fought, but I don't remember these things. I just wish my boys were here now with me instead of doing this. After the benediction of the service, the song Baby Shark was played, which was one of the favorites for some of those boys. Now there is a GoFundMe started for the family to help with funeral costs and rebuilding the home that they also lost in that fire. We'll have a link to that on the web version of the story on KTTC.com. In Mason City, Darian Letty, KTTC News. A hard day, Darian.